Gang Tormentor Dave here. I want to demonstrate to you our Shockliner bar, which is totally different than the others. This one here you can actually deploy upside down. It'll write itself automatically. You don't have to lay it in the water a certain way to make it work. So here we go. Upside down. Right now, I lock it up. Pick up the right side up. Our bird, unlike most of the other birds on the market, are made out of ABS plastic. Most other birds are made out of polypropylene. Why is this important? Well, polypropylene will not hold paint, so you cannot get a beautiful paint job. But more importantly, okay, with polypropylene, you cannot glue a rudder to the bird, okay? Now, the other guys are using mechanical fasteners. Now, when a tuna takes off at 30 miles an hour, and with this thing dragging through the water all day long at five knots, maybe seven or eight knots, depending on who's fishing, those mechanically fastened rudders will come loose and sometimes fall completely off. Um, our rudders have never, ever come off. The mechanically fastened rudders sit way down below the bottom of the bird, while ours are embedded in a half inch inside the bird. Then we sand the rudder and then we glue it in with epoxy. This is bulletproof. Another important issue is we through wire our bird, okay, with what's been tested at 400 pounds. So you'll get no chafing of mono where it passes through the bird. If you pass mono through the bird, it is definitely going to chafe at the nose and the tail end. As far as I know, we are still the only manufacturer that is tipping our bars with rubber so that it doesn't scratch up your boat or your legs. Now, we hear lots of reports of chains flipping over and diving, okay, while you're trolling them with the other brands. Ours will never do this. Why? Because here on the outboard side, okay, we have two ounces of lead embedded in this squid. Now this is only on the one side, not over on this side, because the water pressure is trying to turn this thing upside down as it's going through the water. So this weight here keeps that level. You can actually throw our bar in the water upside down and let it out 10 feet, lock up the reel, and it will right itself in like a half a second. 